I discovered five insane keyword research methods using GenSpark that work better than expensive tools like AREFs. Hey guys, and welcome to Vlad's Insights, where each day I share one valuable insight from my vast collection of 400 plus videos. These five methods use GenSpark's super agent and cost nothing while delivering results that paid tools can't match. Method one, underserved product reviews. I asked GenSpark for 20 AI text humanization tools launched in 2025, then have it check Google for existing reviews. It shortlisted tools like Monica AI Humanizer, Twain GPT, and Keeper SciEye with limited review coverage. Method two, content gap analysis. I provide my sitemap and a competitor's sitemap. GenSpark performs automated analysis and suggests 20 new blog post ideas based on what my competitor covers that I don't. Method three, SEO heist. I feed a competitor's sitemap to GenSpark and it extracts all keywords organized in topical clusters. For example, analyzing originality.ai revealed clusters like AI content detection, plagiarism and academic integrity and readability tools. Method four, proxy keywords. I start with low competition keywords from free tools, then ask GenSpark for 30 similar keywords. I validate these using free keyword volume checkers to find hidden gems. Method five, forum keywords. I ask GenSpark to find keywords that Reddit ranks for on page one. For pugs, it found pug dental care, pug harness recommendations, and pug stubborn behavior, all ranking on page one. Practical advice. Use Google AI Studio for initial tool lists to save GenSpark credits. Validate proxy keywords with free volume checkers. Focus on emerging niches for underserved reviews. And always check forum rankings manually to confirm results. Check out my Words at Scale school community, where I share all of my personal SEO ranking secrets and copywriting workflows, including the complete GenSpark Academy with all these keyword research methods.